Now, let us see how the um, cerebral hemisphere is attached to the brain stem. Okay, for your orientation, this is the the corpus callosum here. Okay, this is here. Okay, this is the thalamus. Okay, if I pull this here, okay, this is the internal capsule, and these are the ascending and the descending fibers that running between the brain stem and the cerebral hemisphere. These are motor fibers and sensory fibers running in opposite direction. Okay, this is the internal capsule. Now, if we go to the ventral aspect and we follow the optic track, this is the optic track, it will go and it will end at the lateral geniculate nucleus, which is the relay for the visual, the visual pathway. Okay? Now, this structure here, this too is the rostral colliculi or the rostral colliculus. And this one here, okay, this is the rostral colliculus, and this is here, this is the caudal colliculus. So these two are the rostral colliculi, and these two are the caudal colliculi. Always, if you want to locate, now I completely remove the cerebral hemisphere from the brain stem. This is the internal capsule. This is the thalamus. If I go in between here, okay. This is the interthalamic adhesion, okay. Rostral colliculi, caudal colliculi, okay. This is the optic tract, and the optic tract ends at this lateral geniculate nucleus, which is the relay for the visual for the visual pathway. This is structure here, this is the middle geniculate nucleus, and this involved with the uh, auditory pathway. Okay. Um, I think that is it here. And um, the Rostral colliculus and the caudal colliculus, these four pump like structure, they call them the corpora quadrigemina because it is four lumps. Okay? So it consists of the rostral colliculi and the caudal colliculi.